Hip Hop Studies with Academia is, I want to say, maybe 25 years old. Uh, it came to be in 1994 when Trisha Rose came out with a, a similar book called Black Noise. And so she was the person that laid the foundation for hip hop studies within academia. And subsequently, and from the mid 90s to the late 90s, you had other pivotal scholars who uh, also joined the conversation within uh, hip hop studies in academia. When it talk about hip hop studies, it is spread across the academy in uh, multiple disciplines. Uh, you have hip hop studies in history. You also have hip hop studies and communication studies with the work of people like Aisha Durham, Robin Boylan, also people who introduced hip hop feminism to the academy. Also, I'm really excited to, for this ideal of uh, culture-centered pedagogy and how I think that's kind of evolving out of hip hop, uh, hip hop studies and hip hop pedagogy, but transforming classrooms so that they speak to um, the cultures that the students come from.